Apps. They are a very important part of our everyday lives. We communicate, pay bills, order food, and even track our health with apps. Obviously, apps are a very important part of our everyday lives, but most of us have no idea how they are made. So, how are apps made? Mobile apps, at a high level, are made from writing code. But, besides writing tons of lines of code, there is a lot more that goes into their creation. First, before any code is written, app designers will design the app. This includes figuring out the color scheme, the app icon design, and the overall app layout. Designers will plan out and design how each screen of the mobile app will look. They will also plan out the navigation of the app. They will do this by figuring out how users will progress to different screens within the app by deciding which buttons, when clicked, will lead to which app screens. From this design, app creators can easily visualize not only how the app will look, but also see how users will interact with the mobile app. From this, developers can flush out any issues that might be confusing to users or mislead them within the app. They can do this before they start any development, hence saving them a ton of time and money during the development process. Once the app is fully designed, developers can do what they do best, write code. There are multiple coding languages that can be used to develop mobile apps. If you choose to go the native route, you will need to write apps in Java for Android devices, and you will need to write code in Swift for iOS devices. You can also do cross-platform development by using frameworks like React Native and Flutter. These frameworks allow you to write code one time using the same coding language. Once completed, you can then build and deploy the app to iOS and Android devices without having to write the code twice, saving you half the time. Likewise, for mobile games, you can use platforms such as Unity to achieve the same goal. Finally, once your app is developed, tested, and ready for users to use, you will need to deploy the app to the Google Play Store and the Apple App Store. While this might seem like the end of the road for app creators, this is actually only the beginning. Now app creators need to shift their focus to the most important part of app development, getting people to download and use your app. This is no easy feat, but if you do a good job of designing and developing your app so that it gives the user the best user experience possible, then getting people to download and use your app will be that much easier. If you have an app idea and you are still not sure how to get started, drop some of your questions in the comments section. Also, if you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Likewise, if you want a more hands-on experience, you can book a consultation with us at www.atsapllc.com. Let's build together.